Vlogmas Day 8. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. I'm in these new PJs I got from Lunia. They're so comfortable. They're like flannel PJs. I have quite literally no food and it's like aching. My kitchen is aching for me to go grocery shopping. I get very lazy here with grocery shopping. Today we've got a lot of errands to run because tonight I'm hosting Secret Santa for me, Katie, Margo, Margo, and Brooke. I am so excited to see who has me. I'll tell you guys now because this will be up tomorrow. I have Katie, Katie Vladi. I'm so excited and she put on her wish list that she wants someone to like buy her clothes for fall winter like style her and i was like this is so much pressure so i already got a couple things from zara last week for her but i want to get like one or two more things today and i need to buy like a cute gift bag all the things that's on the agenda today also grabbing lunch with a big youtube day love that very wholesome um grabbing lunch today with shelby church and christy vetter two of my very good friends from youtube that i've known for literally years christy lives in new york and i haven't seen her yet and shelby's just here for the week so i think after i get lunch with them i'll, I'll we'll be in soho so i'm gonna do some shop the rest of my shopping then um, also want to either do like a Trader Joe's union market grocery store situation shopping mode because we're all just like bringing something tonight so we can all be fed. So I know Brooke's making like spinach artichoke dip. Um, Margo Lee was talking about bringing like veggie tray, you know, something like that. I'm going to do a cheese board. So I have to go get all those things and I might get a couple of things just because I'm the host. I don't even have Keurig pods right now. I like I am, I don't have eggs, like I'm so hungry. So we're gonna make oatmeal, <laughs> which I feel like is just such a sad meal, but it is filling and it is good and we do like it. I just got a Vlogmas day seven yesterday and um, we announced our like merch drop official on Instagram cause that's going live tomorrow. As you guys are watching this, Gals in the Go merch is going live at 1 p.m. Eastern time today, Thursday, December 9th. Um, and, oh, and posting stuff for the podcast because we had a new podcast episode go up today. So lots to be done on Wednesday mornings. I'm going to make my oatmeal and just do some things around here. But wanted to give you guys the lowdown as I always do. Okay, I just decided and just did um, a grocery delivery order from Instacart. I created my cheese board online and I also um, just ordered a ton of groceries because I have literally nothing, as I was saying before. Now we get ready. We do the whole thing. I need to shower really quick. It's like 40 degrees outside, so I'm gonna put on a, a warm fit. And we're gonna go to lunch with Shelby and Christy, and then we're gonna shop right after. All right, we're all bundled up. I got ready in 20 minutes. I'm pretty proud of myself. Just did my everyday makeup. I'm dealing with a little calic situation up there. Here is my outfit. This turtleneck sweater is from Zara, a gold day jeans, white Air Force Ones, my aloe jacket I will link it below. I think I'm gonna buy it in black because it's seriously so comfortable and it's literally last night it was a walking blanket and I was so warm and then my stod moon bag headed to the Dutch let's go Just leaving lunch now. It was so yummy and I love those girls so much. We've all known each other for so long from YouTube and it was so nice to catch up. We're gonna get some Christmas shopping done now. I'm gonna get the rest of Katie's gift, another gift, and hopefully find something for Ryan. Sounds of the city. I wanna get Ryan like a nice coat and then I think sushi making classes. So Ryan, don't. I, hope, I really hope he didn't listen to that. I definitely don't think he did. But yeah, we're gonna see how much shopping I can do before I have a call at four. But yeah, we're in Soho, baby.
Okay, I found Katie this beautiful green scarf that I think she's gonna really like and it's perfect for this time of year. So free, that was the biggest free people I've ever been to in my entire life, by the way. Okay, now we're gonna attempt to shop for men's clothing. I wanna find Ryan a nice coat. Please wish me luck as I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, I just had the best idea. I bought myself a couple coats from Mango recently and they're like fairly priced but really good quality and they're, they have men's clothes. I just looked it up. So I'm gonna go to the Mango on Broadway in Soho and see if I can find Ryan a nice coat. I'm literally so excited. He's gonna look so handsome. Pray I find one, but let's go. Yay, we're doing things. Gift shopping is so fun. I should listen to Christmas music while I do this. No luck at Mango. They sold out of the one I want. I want to get him like a long, like a light gray coat. I just think that looks so good. So a Banana Republic's across the street. I don't know. I'm just going to go into every store that has men's clothing at this point. Updates to come. Someone said I should make updates to come merch. Do I say it that much? I'm not a, I'm not against it. You guys, I found a coat at Zara, believe it or not. I'm so happy. Now I'm gonna literally stop by the gals in the go office because I have to pee. I do this all the time. I literally love this office so much. I'll show you guys really quick what I got. Um, ooh, the light, hello light. That's very nice. Um, I'm actually gonna sit here and do some emails too, so it's kind of perfect. Actually, maybe we don't like that light. Okay. So the scarf I got Katie, I love it. I really wanted it for myself, and I was like, no, no. I'm not gonna buy two, just one for Katie. It's this super thick, green, chunky scarf. I'm obsessed. It's perfect. I, I hope she's gonna like it. I think she's gonna like it. I already got her a couple things that I'll show you guys when I get home but I feel so much pressure like to style someone. It's so scary. And she literally looks good in everything, so that's good. But yeah, Zara, um, I got this beanie for myself. It's from the men's section, but I love this green color. I've been looking for a good green beanie, so really pumped about that. I found a coat for Ryan. It's literally exactly what I envisioned. I wanted a long gray coat. So yeah, I'm gonna sit here and respond to a couple emails. I'm gonna go pee, and then we're gonna go, I think I'm gonna stop by Abode on Elizabeth Street. It's so cute, they have the best gifts. And one of you guys in the comments gave me an idea to get um, a sushi ornament for Ryan and like put on it like sushi making classes or something. I'm trying to decide actually if I should get him sushi making classes or I think one of you told me to try this restaurant called Masa. It's like a private Japanese cuisine experience which is also so his vibes. I don't know which one he'd like better, like the experience or making it himself. So they're both experiential, but, and I also want to grab a gift for my friend Erica that I'm going to brunch with tomorrow. So yeah. Just got home hopping on a Gals on the Go merch 2022 um, planning call, I'm excited. They just sent us over this really cool deck with some, this is our calls with Fanjoy and then our managers as well. So I'm excited to chat. Oh, she's got Galentine's Day ideas on here. Some other little ideas. And then we have our own ideas as well. We want to do some more like accessories for the podcast merch as well. So going to hop on this now and yeah. Okay. Bye. We're doing a second launch and I think it's super smart that we're doing it on demand too so that it gets to the fans. And really, and this meeting is really just to kind of go over our previous sales. I know that- Just finished both of our calls. Now I just, my groceries just got delivered, which is just so nice. I was literally on my call. My groceries got put at my door. So thankful for Instacart. Um, I have a couple bags, so I'm just gonna start here with the haul. Um, just typical things I always get, plus the cheese board stuff for tonight. Blueberries, kombucha. I'll show you, I'll build the cheese board with you guys later. So we'll go through that. Baby carrots, eggs, broccoli. So this is the first drop. <laughs> All right, drop number two. It's like merch drop. No, just my second round of groceries here. Whole wheat bread. I love Annie's mac and cheese. A couple versions of bonza pasta. It's chickpea pasta. Oh, these go in my cheese board area. Um, black beans, chicken noodle soup, tomato sauce, rice, and apples. That is the grocery haul. Oh, I also got more LaCroix. This is the Raz Cranberry flavor. And just look at all the array of um, canned beverages. Brooke just stopped by and dropped off her person's, or half of her person's gift. She, I, I don't even know, she came in hot. She has to go do a couple more things. It was really funny. She like came in, she had a Santa sack of goodies and then 
She's running errands. We still have two hours till our Secret Santa, and I, I don't know why it feels so late. Probably because it's dark outside. So I'm just putting away the groceries now. Um, yeah. Okay, party prep begins now. I'm so excited. I love hosting. So I'm gonna take you guys along on me prepping to have some gals over. So we decided tonight it's PJ attire. Um, it didn't have to be Christmas PJs. It could be sweatpants, it could be pajama set, whatever everyone has. So I'm trying to decide between these two. I either have this green set that I just got from American Eagle. Um, I know Brooke also has the red one. So there's a chance she might be wearing this. <laughs> um, or I have this one from the Daily Sleeper that I actually, I think I got for Christmas last year. And I love it because it has the furry bottoms, but it's like tan and those are festive. So I'm gonna try them both and see it, but let's change into pajamas. Ta-da! So I tried on the green one and it's really cute, but um, it's not the most flattering, not that it matters. And I just love this set from the Daily Sleeper. It's got the feathery little pants. Now let's head to the living room. I need to wrap Katie's gift. Let's go. All right, so I'll show you guys what I got Katie last week. So you guys saw the scarf that I got her, the green one that I personally want as well. And then last week I went to Zara and just picked out a couple things for her. This first top I saw and it just is so cute. It's perfect for like, I just so see Katie in this. It would look so good with her short dark brown hair. It's just like um, a turtleneck with a super big cutout twist at the bottom. This green color is obviously so in, but it's also long sleeve. I see her wearing this with her leather leggings. Like I just see this for her and I hope she likes it. I'm so nervous. I'm literally gonna be like, here's the gift receipt. If you don't like anything, it's fine. I can see Katie in this. I hope she likes it. If she doesn't, again, whatever. Um, she'll just get something else. But I love this. Everything's from Zara, by the way. This brown mock neck little top. It's ribbed, actually kind of warm, good for layering. And then over top, I thought this blazer it was so cute. I have one kind of similar. I love it. And then look, there's elbow patches. So cute. I just see this for Katie. Hopefully she likes what I got her. I'm genuinely terrified, but we're just gonna hope and pray that she likes it. And I gotta save all these. <laughs> receipts for her my goodness so i'm gonna wrap that now i stopped by this store called the modern chemist it's kind of like a paper source if you guys know those stores they have like candles and gift wrap and cards oh my it's really really cute so i got a few of these gift bags which i love they say merry christmas and they're so festive and some tissue paper and yeah, I am I am not great. If I have like a lot of time, I love sitting and wrapping presents with wrapping paper. But since I'm hosting and I have to do the cheese board and a couple other things, this is the vibe we're going for. So I'm excited. And I've got Ryan's coat in there. I'll wrap that at a later date. Presents are under the tree. I also forgot to show you guys. I am unwrapping it because, well, actually this is kind of dumb. I'm unwrapping it. I'm just gonna have to rewrap it. Or I, I need to do something with it first, so I had to unbox it. Um, I took your guys' advice. I got a sushi ornament from Abode. And I don't know, I'm gonna like attach something to it. I don't know, this is how I'm gonna tell Ryan I'm getting him something sushi related, either the making classes or the experience, so. Thought this was perfect. All right, it's now time for cheese board preparation because I don't like when the cheese is like freezing cold. So I want to get it out now. So by the time they get here, the breeze at a good temperature, everything's good. I know I don't have all my cheese boards here. Um, so this is going to be interesting. I'll probably have to do a couple little mini boards. I do have this bigger one. I have some great ones that I think I still have at home that I need to bring up here actually. Um, but this is one of them I'm pulling out. And then I have this. This is actually really small. Wow. Uh, so that's really all I have. And then huh, these are like wooden. I guess I haven't used them yet. Um, so we're going to play around with that. 
Okay, so here's everything we're working with for the cheese board. I got salami. I'm actually not personally a fan. Oh, I just realized they forgot the prosciutto. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, well, I prefer prosciutto, but I got both. Um, this is something Delaney and I used to do. We always like to get mozzarella balls, and then I also got um, French baguette, and it tastes so good dipping it in olive oil with the moth balls, so good. And then I got olives, I don't know, something to put on the board. These, I'm cheating, they're cracker cuts, so they're cheddar cheese, but they're like perfectly cut already to put on crackers. And then these are the other three cheeses I got. I got brie, manchego, and asiago with rosemary and olive oil. So hopefully it's up to everyone's standards. I also went ahead and got a bottle of Prosecco in case people want something sparkling. I have been really into, during the winter I always love doing this, um, either coffee with Bailey's Irish cream or hot chocolate and I have both if people want. And then I got some Kim Crawford Sauvignon Blanc. So a couple different options. You gotta do it as a host. Um, so I need to actually put these in the refrigerator right now. Wow, I had low expectations for my cheese board because I just haven't done one in so long. I'm out of my game, but I mean, I think this looks pretty great. I meant to buy some herbs that I could like sprinkle over to make it look aesthetically pleasing, like some rosemary or something, but that's okay. I knew I'd have an overflow, so I pulled out this board as well. I, I, I don't know. I really just did like a random salami river situation. I don't know what that was. That's like a bridge over the river maybe. We'll do that. <laughs> Hopefully it ends up well, hopefully everyone likes it. Now I have this whole mess from making the cheese board. So good thing, actually, I do have all this time because I have time to clean this all up. <laughs> all right, the guests are about to start arriving. I'm so dramatic. Um, I'm just so proud of how clean my apartment is right now. This is also a better look at the PJs I'm wearing. They're from the Daily Sleeper. I love the bottoms, they're so cute. The color is not very festive, but I just, I love the set, so. Yay! Merry, Merry! <laughs> Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Oh my God. A gift for you, a gift for you! <laughs> and then it's our day for you! Oh my God! For biz, guys. You guys are witnessing my oven being used for the first time. I can't believe you don't use it, but I guess you, you really do everything in the pan. And yeah. And air fryer. But really now, like pan. you using it for the first time, I'm gonna be like, okay, I'll use it now. Gotcha. Okay. I just needed it to be broken in and I didn't want to be alone. I don't know why. I see that. Brooke made some spinach artichoke dip. I'm very excited. Yes, so you. fun. I wanna oil it because then it gets all crispy on the top. Ooh, you know what I mean? yes. Oh, yes. Oh my gosh, that's so, I'm so, look at you, a big I, chef these I'm days. I'm chef, I really changed my life in the past. I love it. <laughs> oh, I know, I'm just gonna pop this. We're getting the Prosecco open, baby. I'm at Danielle's now, we're gonna start the glass. I'm nervous because the guy came in hot, my delivery guy. So oh, you I'm, got that delivered? Yeah, I'm nervous that it's, oh, it was did. shaking, not yes, stirred. Right. <laughs> shaking. <laughs> Woo! I always get so nervous opening them. I literally think I'm going to die. Now I'm the only timely one. So I tried on those pajamas. You guys know they didn't work, so I just put on the sweatshirt. That's what I told them to. Oh, meant for oh no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Artichoke dips in the oven. Margo ordered, Margo Oshry ordered. Joe's pizza as her, as her, um, what's the word? Contribution. Yes, very sweet. Yay! People are arriving to my party. People came. They showed up. Katie brought some Magnolia Bakery. Oh my gosh, we have another guest. Ho, ho, ho. Max, oh my gosh. So exciting. I'm so happy to see you, cutie. Hi. I am so excited. Does it matter which one I open? No, no, it's just a ton of clothes, so. Oh, just a ton. I mean, not a ton, a ton, I should have gotten, oh. but. All right, so, so this is a moment, as Margo would say. So it's the, with the other thing in the bag, too. Oh, so that's gorgeous. A little green I top. Mean, well, green is like my color. Yeah. So yeah. Oh, like yeah, I knew that, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> and then this is a uh, scarf from this Free is, People. This is what everyone's wearing now. Yeah, yeah. It is. It's like the big, they chunky. Scarf, they go like. Yes, just the one flip. Yes. Yep. Yes. yes. Oh my god. Fucking iconic. Like this. Yeah. Multi. Yes. Oh. Wow. Multifunctional. Look at her. Oh my gosh, Katie, oh, you really killed this. 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Max, it's you. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. That's sick. Yeah, you needed the extra attachment. Wow. Should I take it off? Yeah, take it off just because you probably wanted the back to Oh my god, this is so elite. Shut up. Is it a giant candle? Stop! It's the big one? Oh my god! You will never need another one ever again. This is iconic. I know. You just like Oh my god! I do! Wait, is it tall? Yeah. Oh, that is a plant pot. That is <laughs> awesome. Wait. Oh, yeah, of course. I love it. I was one who kept poking That's you to put your fucking wish list. What's the name? What's the name? It's Cypress. Yay! Oh, really? But Wait, I see what it is. That's just killing me. Oh, my God. Yeah. Beautiful. Yes. Wait, I didn't know they had this color. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. Oh, it's like mine. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yay. 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 Thank you. I love you. Everyone just left. They all helped me clean. It honestly looks just about how they left it. They just all, I was like, please take food. And they all just left all the goodies. So I'm not mad about it, you know? Like, we love that. Um, so I'm about to go to bed. I'm honestly so sleepy, but I vlogged everyone else's, but I didn't vlog myself. Um, Margot Lee had me for Secret Santa. She got the cutest little gift. She called it a whole moment. It's like a spa bath moment. So she got me a spa bath pillow, which I'm really pumped about. Also, you guys know my obsession with Lalabo right now. She got me this Sintal 33 shower gel, which I'm literally about to put in my shower. This stuff smells so good. I have the candle. I have the laundry detergent, I literally have it all. And a Barefoot Dreams robe. I am so bummed about this because I only live in my Barefoot Dreams blankets and I always have them wrapped around me and then I'll like get up and go walk somewhere and then it's like falling off. But this is basically like a clothing version of that where I have it on me at all times, you can tie it around. So very sweet, very thoughtful. And I'm hyped because this bag is perfect for regifting, like this gift bag. This will be perfect for me to put Ryan's um, coat that I got him in. <laughs> it's the little things in life. So it was such a sweet little gift. Everyone was so thoughtful. And then we all just hung out and talked for hours. I mean, everyone just left like, I don't know, 30 minutes ago. It's 12.45 now. So it was just a very wholesome night. And we were like, we need to do this more. There's just nothing like sitting in a living room and talking to some of your best friends. It's just, the best feeling and I'm so thankful. We're, we're all so thankful that we have such a genuine group of girls that are also on social media, but like it's just a really good group and we're always just talking about each other's lives and like giving advice and laughing. It was just a lovely night and we wanna do more things like that. It makes me, I don't know, this whole night was like stuff we did in college all the time. Like Delaney and I would make a cheese board and like I'd put the Yule log on and we all just sit on the floor in the living room and talk, so. And it was to say, you can't do that post-grad. We literally did it tonight. And we were all like, wow, we don't have to go to bougie dinners. We could just sit in the freaking living room and talk and enjoy each other's company. It's so, not that we didn't know that, but I don't know. It, sometimes you have to like put more thought into something like this. Like, okay, we're all gonna go to this person's house and sit in the living room. Cause it sounds weird, but it's just so fun. Anyways, today's been a lovely day. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Tomorrow is a whole other day. I'm vlogging tomorrow too. It's Vlogmas, so subscribe if you guys are new here. I'm so happy you guys are loving the video. Thank you all for all of your advice on my life whenever I ask you guys questions. I think I might stay in New York a couple days. I need to make that decision tomorrow before the flight prices really go up, but I don't know. But either way, I'm really sorry to say Vlogmas is going to end on the 15th. Like, I'm gonna, my last vlog will be on the 15th, just so you guys are aware, but I will be vlogging after that. It's just gonna be like weekend in my life, week in my life, what I was doing before. So anyways, I'm so glad you guys liked it. I love you, I'll see you soon, see you tomorrow.